Hey guys, Terry Marine here with another video. This one for Semper Sunday is talking about Operation Mosh otherwise known as the Battle for Marja over in the Helmand province of Afghanistan. Uh, this battle was, is still, I believe, considered the largest uh, joint operation in the war in Afghanistan. Um, because it involved 15,000 American, Afghan, Canadian, Estonian, Danish, and British troops. Um, and it, uh, the, the goal of it was to take the battle, or take the city of Marja um, from the Taliban because they'd been there for years. <clears throat> and it was also controlled by, by the Taliban as well as drug traffickers that moved a lot of opium in and out of the city. Uh, the the battle was considered a success, um, <clears throat> but the fighting wasn't easy, and it's just difficult to fight insurgents in general. Um, the Marines, what battalions were there? I know 1-3 was there. Uh, I want to say 1-6. Yeah, 1-6 was there. 3-6. Um, <clears throat> a second reconnaissance. A uh, second assault m Assault Amphibian Battalion, Amphibian Assault Battalion, uh, 310, which is uh, artillery. A um, bunch of different Marine units hit this city. They, uh, they, uh, what am I trying to say here? The, they hit it with in both, at night time, they hit it in, uh, through, Helos, they they got flown in on helos as well as on ground, you know, just in a straight up ground uh, <clears throat> attack. Um, let me find this video. There it is. Um, and the Marines hit it hard. They they ran into a lot of issues with roadside bombs and mines. Um, just the streets and the walls being lined with these explosives. Uh, it was very, very dangerous. Um, but they were able to get through it. They did a lot of house-to-house -house fighting. Um, <clears throat> and and it was difficult. I mean, fighting house-to-house -house is never easy. Uh, you, know, you never know where these guys are at. Um, and... Uh, the Marines that fought there, they're all very proud of what they did because they they found thousands and thousands of pounds of of weapons and explosives as well as just tons upon tons of uh, of opium and um, just just a whole variety of drugs that can be made from that sort of stuff. Black tar opium, the, the seeds themselves, the poppy seeds. Um, as well as hashish and heroin, uh, a whole ton of stuff was found and and taken, and I imagine destroyed later. Uh, there's there's some documentaries on this that you should definitely look up and watch. Um, the, the Marines and all the other Allied forces that fought there fought very well, um, dealing with these guys, dealing with these insurgents, uh, with the Taliban. The Taliban fought back hard though. I mean they're they're dicks, but they, they can fight well. There's no doubt about it. Um the eventually by the time it was done, they it cleared the city for the most part and they just absolutely uh what was I saying? I started reading a fact here. They uh they just fought like beasts. Sorry if that's what's not where I was going. Um, with that, but the, the the main issue, like I said a minute ago, was the the bombs, the uh, you know just IEDs in general. And it said in the first thirty days, Marines with one sixth found or hit more than one hundred and twenty of the bombs in the first thirty days of the battle. I mean that that's just an insane amount of IEDs to to go off or to be found, and the issue comes from you clear a stretch of road for instance um, you clear a stretch of road and then you go back the next day and the roads covered in these bombs again because every single night the
Taliban would sneak in and plant more. And, uh, and that made it very difficult to move around because an area that you thought was safe is not safe. And it's just what these Marines, what the other guys had to deal with. Um, <clears throat> overall, let's see. Oh, here's the list. Join the Marines with, from the that fought were a part of the Seventh uh, Marine Regiment. So you have one six, one three, three six. Um, Army's Fourth Battalion, Twenty Third Infantry. Uh, you get three ten, which is artillery. Five eleven, which is high Mars, which is rockets. Um, as well as some Afghan units, Second Engineer Battalion, um, two five. Uh, Company F of 2-5. Uh, Company A, 1st Battalion, 17th Infantry Regiment of the Army. The S Company A, the 2nd Light Armored Reconnaissance Battalion of the Marine Corps. Um, and then a couple other assault battalions and some special forces as well. Um, it constituted a lot of units. and They, they did a lot of good work uh, dealing with that shit. And there's, I know a few Marines that were there, and they said it was... It was uh, an intense battle, I mean, especially when you get into the areas where you know are just full of IEDs and there's not a fucking thing you can do about it. You know, it's just no bueno. But, uh, yeah, total, um, we, luckily we didn't lose a, as many as could have been lost. We did have, Americans had, uh, 45 Americans were killed, 13 British, and 15 plus um, Afghan military, although they haven't given us the official number, apparently. Um, and the Taliban had over 120 killed, as well as uh, 56 captured. Uh, so, all in all, we dealt out a lot more than, than we received, which is good. But it was a rough battle. Definitely look up some of the stuff. Look up the pictures. Look up the you know, little videos, the clips of these Marines fighting. Uh, it's good shit. They, uh, they perform well. There's no doubt about it. All right, guys, if you have any questions, any concerns, anything like that, hit me up, and I will see you in the next one. Simplify.